to do today. Yesterday, I kind of figured out who scammed me. That mom and that daughter that said that my slime turned their skin pink, they made it all up. And they pretended like they had all these bills. And so I ended up selling my car and pretty much everything else to help them pay for those bills. But it turns out they just made it all up. All to get me to close down my slime shop. What a terrible, terrible thing to do. And I found the daughter at the store, and I got proof. But my recording wasn't recording. So today, I have to go over to the police station, tell them what happened, and let them sort all of this out. All right, let's just quickly get ready. All right, let me go and get changed. All right, I'm wearing my slime outfit. And uh, I don't even have time to eat anything. This is way too important. Well, you know what, let me just, you know, let me take a piece of fruit. I'm going to take an apple. Let's get out of here. Let me lock my door too. Probably not even gonna be able to live in that apartment soon. <sighs> let's go to the slime shop and then let's go stop by the police station. Where's my slime shop? My slime shop is gone! Someone destroyed it! Um, who's this? This is, um, do you know what happened to my slime shop? No, I don't. Okay, you kind of look like that mom and that daughter, but no, that's not them. I can't believe it! It's gone! It's gone! Now I'm really going over to the police station. <laughs> They're gonna figure all this out. How could they do this and think that they're going to get away with it? Well, you know what? They are not. Hello? Hello there! Hello, ma'am. How may I help you? I have a problem, officer. Please come around this way. All right, ma'am. What exactly is going on? Well, I'll tell you what's going on. I've been scammed. You've been scammed? Tell me more. Mom! So, what are we going to do today? Did you figure out what you want to do with our new store? No, sweetie, I have not yet. But, <laughs> last night, while everyone was sleeping, we destroyed her slime shop. We completely destroyed it. Boom! Bam! We knocked down all the walls. We turned it into dust. Ooh, dust? That's cool, Mom. So what's gonna happen now? Did anyone see you guys when you destroyed her slime shop? No, sweetie. No one saw us. We wouldn't be that, you know, obvious. Okay. Ah! This is awesome. This is so awesome, Mom. Okay, sweetie, but you, you need to go and get ready. I don't know why you're still wearing the same outfit from yesterday. Because it is beautiful, Mother. Okay, well, go and take a shower and get freshened up, at least. All right. La, 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 la. So you're saying that someone pretended like you caused her daughter's skin to become pink and that she had all kinds of hospital bills and you had to pay them? Yes, that is exactly what I'm saying. Do you have any proof of this? Did she ever show you the hospital bills, ma'am? No, she did not. I just, I just, I just believed her. Well, now look where you are. Who is this woman that you're saying did this? It's that lady that lives over there with her daughter. And, and how could she do this to me? Listen, ma'am, do you have any proof or something? I can go and talk to her, but you need proof. Well, I, I talked to the daughter, and the daughter admit to it when she was at the store. Did you get that on camera? Um, no, because when I pulled out my recording device, she noticed it and she wouldn't talk anymore. So, basically, it's your word against hers. Yes, but there's something else. They also destroyed the shop. Last night when I went to sleep, my shop was still there. And when I woke up this morning, someone had destroyed it. It's nothing but dust on the ground. Dust on the ground. And 
how do you know that it was the woman? Um, I'm just, I, I can only assume that it was her. I don't really have any proof of that either. Ma'am, I can try to investigate this, but I can't do anything without proof. Okay, I'm going to get that proof, no matter what. This is their house right here, and I think they're up there right now. How can I get in there to listen to their conversations or at least find proof? I can't just walk into her house, then she'll call the police on me, and then I'll be the one that's in trouble. Hmm, maybe I can hear something through the glass. Oh, sweetie, get out here. I have to talk to you about something. Okay, Mom. Uh, one second, I was doing something. Okay, I'm all fresh. What's going on, Mother? Well, I have a lot of business to take care of with trying to figure out, you know, how we're going to get that property for whatever shop that we are going to open up here. Okay, what does that have to do with me? Well, you are going to need, I don't know, a nanny or someone to take care of you while I handle all of those things. Mom! I do not need a nanny. Um, I can take care of myself. Come on now. No. You cannot take care of yourself. I'm going to be interviewing some people, and we'll see who the best candidate is, and that will be the person that will be your nanny while I get this figured out. But, Mom, I don't want a nanny. I don't need a nanny. I thought we were partners in crime. Yes, sweetie, but you still need a nanny. So they need a nanny, huh? Okay, then. I'm going to be that nanny, but I still look like myself. I still look like the slime shop girl, so I'm going to have to get another disguise. And this disguise cannot look like, oh, is she looking at me? Oh, no, no, no. And this disguise cannot look like the one from the other day. So I'm going to have to go back to that store and come up with a really, really good disguise. And then I'm going to go interview for the job of the nanny. Let's see. Um, come on, let's. Mm, okay, I'm definitely gonna have to get rid of the green hair. Green hair is a definite no. All right, this looks good. I don't look like myself at all. Let me go and pay for this. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, now, oh, it's already dark outside. Okay, let me go knock on the door. Wait, how am I gonna explain how I know that they're looking for a nanny? Hmm, I guess I'll just wing it. Um, hello, how may I help you? Um, hello there, miss. I was, um, I just moved into the town. You know, I was, uh, working at a school before I moved here to, um, Unicorn City, and I was wondering if you guys had any work. Any work? What does that mean? Um, I don't know, like maybe a nanny or something like that? Oh, well, yes. I am looking for a nanny. How did you know that? Oh, I didn't know that. I was just, I was just knocking on everyone's door here in Unicorn City, so I just thought that I would knock on yours too. Well, where exactly did you say that you worked before? Um, I worked at this little place called Little Angels Daycare, and I was really great there. Well, why did you stop working there? Well, because it's really far, and I'm trying to find work near where I live. Oh. Okay, well, you know what? Mm, I don't feel like interviewing a lot of different people, so I guess you're hired. But I'm going to be keeping a very close eye on you. And I will be calling the Little Angels Daycare to make sure that you work there. Okay, yeah, sure, sure. So when do I start work? You can start working here tomorrow. Be on time. Goodbye. I got the job. I can't believe she just hired me like that though. But she said she's gonna call Little Angel's Daycare to see if I actually worked there. And I haven't actually worked there. So let's just hope that she was just bluffing and doesn't actually plan on calling them. But either way, I start work tomorrow. And while I'm working there, I'm going to be going through all of their stuff trying to find proof of what they did to my slime shop and once i find that proof i'm taking it to the police station and i will finally get my justice for them destroying my slime shop 
<laughs> they don't know who they messed with, but they are about to find out now. Thank you for watching my channel. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so.